Hey guys, we just wanted to take a second to let you know that GMM is up for show of the year at the Streamy Awards. But we need your votes and tweets to win. You can vote by tweeting, I vote for hashtag Good Mythical Morning for show of the year at the hashtag Streamies, or you can vote by clicking on the link in the description. Now your tweets have to include hashtag Good Mythical Morning, the word vote, and hashtag Streamies. You can also retweet our tweet, and that will count as a vote. Voting continues through September 17th, and you can tweet vote 100 times per day. Press pause now and do it. Let's show the world what mythical beasts are made of. Uh, Thanks for being your mythical best. If it's good enough for a baby, it's good enough for two man babies. Let's talk about that. Good. Mythical morning. Baby food, we've all had it, but you probably don't remember what it tastes like because you were a baby. Unless you were a very hungry, confused mom or a YouTuber doing the baby food challenge. But we feel in order to taste the food of the baby, we need to first become babies, both physically and mentally. Yes, it's time to play. What sort of mushy mush are we shoving into our mushy baby mouths? Hi, I'm a baby. Hi, I'm a baby. Yeah, he's a baby. That guy over there is also a baby and we're gonna be tasting food for us today. I am this excited about eating baby food. And I'm this excited that I'm doing this dance, yay. Okay, here's how this is gonna work. We're gonna be tasting some traditional baby foods and identifying the ingredients. And we're also gonna be tasting some non-traditional baby foods, some foods that typically are not put into baby foods that the crew has concocted. Why are we floating, woo! We're magic babies. All right, so the winner gets to eat a food baby, which don't panic, it's just a big burrito. <laughs> and the loser has to mix all of the uh, baby foods together and eat some of that. That'll Ooh. be you, brother. Let's do it. Round one. Okay, uh, this first round we've got a one ingredient baby food, so there is one point on the board. One point, all right, bring it in. Yeah. Uh, could you deliver this first one like a plane, guys? Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. Eh. Mm. Wow, mm. that is not a good taste. Mm, I'm glad I'm not a baby anymore. Ooh, wow, there's a... Well, I could tell that it was green because I saw it and it was green. You know what, I didn't even look at the color. How did I miss that? Well, it was green, I just told you. I just gave you a hint. Um, but I, the taste is very, very specific. I continue to this day to eat this food. <laughs> okay, you guys ready to answer? Yes. Let me have the answer in three, two, one. Peas! You Which I just did in my correct. pants. Garden peas. All right, we both got that one. That was easy, yo, for I. I eat a lot of garden peas even now, and once I chew them up in my mouth, they turn into baby food. I pee in the garden. <laughs> <laughs> Round two. All right, another point up for grabs. Let me grab it, let me grab it, bring it in. Mm, like a train, please. Mmm. Uh, mm. I like it, this one. It's almost <laughs> good. I like it. Mmm, this takes me back. Mm, it takes me way back. I would back. say it's not good, but it's almost good. No, I could live off this. It's like, it's like if a fruit roll up melted and you ate, all the sugar left it and then you ate it. This is the food uh, that you have at the beginning and the end of your life. In the middle of your life, you don't eat it. Oh, you're gonna give me a hint. Okay, mm. now I've got a good guess. Hmm. Um, hmm, are you, is that a is that a diversion? Oh, thing? maybe. Are you playing the game with me? Maybe. No. All right. Answers in three, two, one. Prunes! I, I definitely is prunes. I've eaten a lot of prunes. Wow, you're both correct. All right. Yay! You, you didn't eat a hint, did you? You knew that. No. I, in college, I would eat a lot of prunes. You, you did. remember that? You, you were the prune king. Like, I discovered them in you? college. They had this little Ziploc of prunes all the time. It's like the budget friendly apricot. <laughs> Round three. Okay. <laughs> Got restless out, leg syndrome. I just figured out how to kick my legs. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this round uh, is worth two points because apparently there's more than one ingredient. Uh, let's bring it in. Bring it in, guys. Can you do it like a fishy? Mm -hmm. Like a fishy swimming into Ooh, my mouth. It's gloppy. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> mm. mm. <Ew. laughs> Mushy. Yeah. Uh. What? You know what? 
It's not bad. I know my face is saying this is bad. <laughs> what? I have no idea. It needs salt or whatever it is. <laughs> I think uh, I know one of them. I think it's more than one thing. What goes with that though? I wish, I'm trying to find some more of my teeth so I can taste it. Do you need another more. bite? Can I have, please have another bite? <laughs> please, please don't do that. Please. That is so unpleasant. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't know you as a baby. Mm. Well, it looked like sweet potatoes or squash, but it doesn't taste like either one of those things, does it? I ain't answering you. I think no. I got, I think I have a guess for at least part of it. Okay. Okay. All right. I need your answer in three, two, one. Beef Onion stew and sweet and potatoes. And carrots. <laughs> beef stew and carrots. You ain't feeding no baby beef stew, man. You could. Uh, they can eat sweet, I, sweet potato and something else, and I said onions. Okay, guys, it's spaghetti and cheese. What? <laughs> See, I told you. Are you kidding me? Beef stew is the closer than spaghetti. I, I mean, can, closer than whatever you You gotta consider. heat that up first. <laughs> I think. I was gonna say Chef Boyardee at some point, but I didn't wanna insult the man. Round four. All right, so now up for grabs, we've got one, two, three points. It's getting complicated. <laughs> All right, bring it oh, in. Bring it over like a. Like a zookeeper feeding a gorilla. A rabbit gorilla. <coughs> uh, <laughs> um. <laughs> mm. I'm gonna need some more of that. I want some more of that. Mm. Mm. That's good. If it was on my finger, I'd lick it. <laughs> oh, I, I, I can't. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me some more. Hmm. <laughs> Chase turns the spoon upside down in my mouth. Does, he, does Lizzie do that for you? No. You should really look into that. He's feeding Australian babies. <laughs> I'm sucking on my thinking thumb. <laughs> do I have a thinking thumb? Yeah, see what you th <laughs> see, see, see what you think about it. I can barely reach my thinking thumb. <laughs> my uh, thinking thumb. I need to work on my flexibility. Uh, All right, I've got two. I, I need I've got, one. I, I have two ingredients as well. Uh, all right. I'm gonna go for three. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Uh, here we go. Three, two, one. Banana, banana peach, pineapple, mango. peach. Oh, we both said banana and peach. Okay, so you're both correct. It is banana and peach. And then, then there's one more. I said, I said pineapple, mango. It's oatmeal. <laughs> oh, hey, oatmeal. Oh, Listen, <laughs> but hey, that was pretty good. Banana and peach. Yeah, that's some good tasting. Yeah. What? Well, I can't quite. Round five. All right, this round uh, is one of the first crew concoctions. So hmm. non-traditional baby foods, and it's worth two points. Boom, boom. <laughs> two, Woo. two points. All right, bring it on over like it's a creepy, creepy monster. <laughs> oh, I'm afraid. I'm afraid of. Oh, it's like something chewy in there. There's bone in I'm mine. I'm gonna need some more. I'm gonna need some more. Why is there bone in mine? What, all right there? Oh, you got bone? It's so, why'd you get so much, Chase? That's fine, I need to taste it. Uh, I didn't ask for any more. <laughs> it's still in my mouth. I don't want any more of that bony stuff. <laughs> all right, I'll take it. Oh. Hell! Uh, gross. It tastes just like something that I can't think of. What uh, is all that? right, I got it. Okay, well, I okay. don't know. Three, two, one. Chicken, Chicken and fajita mayonnaise. and hummus. <laughs> so you're um, chicken Link, and you were kind of close. It was chicken enchiladas. <clears throat> there was no hummus in Chicken fajita, chicken enchilada? It was same chicken thing. Chicken enchiladas. That's the same thing. No, that, that enchilada sauce is kind of what yeah, that's, probably tasting. You, that's it. Enchilada sauce. It's so obvious. That's but what I, I meant when I said fajita. You didn't say the right what thing. Even, like, what you know even what? is give, a fajita? I'll give you a point. Fajita is just peppers and chicken put together, but enchilada is tortilla with uh, enchilada sauce and cheese. Yeah, I think I think Link needs to have a point for this round. Okay, Link. 
you can <laughs> have close. a point. Yay! I take the lead! <laughs> <laughs> Round six! Okay, first of all, I would like to point out that a fajita You're not pointing, first is of all. not an enchilada. You have a fist, that's not pointing. I said chicken and mayonnaise. Chicken and mayonnaise could be an enchilada, <laughs> right? I was thinking enchilada, I said fajita, and that's why okay. I'll take a point. All right, well, moving on to the last round, uh, two ingredients, two non-traditional ingredients, and uh, two points on the board. So I could come back and win, or tie it up, or something. All right, how is this one coming, like a helicopter? Your head's a little bit off center, you look like a baby that's been in an accident. There, uh, no. <laughs> My head is off center. Right, okay, here we go. Oh gosh, that's I'll so bring chunky. Bring the helicopter. Bring it from above. It's the helicopter. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you guys didn't do a good job of making. Oh. Uh. Oh. <laughs> so cold. Papery. Ooh. I feel like I've lost it. <laughs> oh, oh God, I'm gonna vomit all over my baby doll. <laughs> we, gotta, we gotta burp this baby over here. <laughs> this baby's about to let, up I, Let me just get a good look at it. I definitely don't, I got plenty in my mouth. Oh. Oh, no! No, no, I can't. <laughs> no, no, no. no baby would, would um, willingly eat this. Um, you give this to a baby, you watch what happens. That baby gonna go on hunger strike. Mm. I got a guess, we'll see. I've got get two guesses. Um, hold on, I gotta get my other guess. I'll suck on my, my thinking thumb while you come over here. All right. Okay. okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Beef Tuna and, and shrimp. Shrimp. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give this one to Rhett. He was very close. It was crab and steak. Um, the what? name of the, the item is surf and turf. Yeah, I almost said crab and beef, but I went with the old beef and shrimp. You mean it wasn't combo. tuna and paper? <laughs> no! <laughs> I thought it was papery, man. Dang. All right, I'll let I you win. have it, because that was pretty close. All right. Okay, I'll uh, I'll eat all of them in one big spoonful. If you will like and comment and subscribe. You know what time it is. Hi, I'm Brett, and this is Afton. We're from Phoenix, Arizona. It's time to spend the week with mythicality. Make sure you check out this week's episode of Ear Biscuits, our podcast with guest Fun for Louie. And make sure you check out tomorrow morning's Song Biscuit, animated Song Biscuit on this channel. Yeah, click through to Good Mythical More. I am going to eat a conglomerate of all of this stuff uh, as my punishment. Uh, not really looking food, forward baby. to that. Oh, winner! Woo! Congratulations to Rat on Bat! You get Merch of the Month. You win a GMM mug! Congratulations! Not this one, though, because I drank out of it and you wouldn't want to do that after You can me. have mine. You ate chili out of Sarah Don's mouth. <laughs> <laughs> she spit it into my mouth. Yeah. yeah. That, that was funny. That's just like this, except it's a spoon, not Sarah John. <laughs> <laughs>